Yo, what it do, YouTube? It's your boy Spray Paint back at you with another video, man. Y'all know what it is when y'all step in the building. Sorry for the wait, but y'all know I was going to keep y'all too late. You did. So, this said, man, we got to talk about Daphne Joy accusing 50 Cent of SA and her. And this all came from when Daphne responded to 50 Cent after he blasted her for being a sex worker for Diddy. But here's the thing. It's not your baby daddy's fault that you inside this lawsuit. If there's anybody you need to point the finger at, a lot of y'all need to point the finger at Lil Rod, bro. Like I said, Lil Rod, Lil Rod lawsuit got everybody shaking in their boots right now. And ever since he came out with this lawsuit, most celebrities been speaking. Y'all could remember when Cassie first said something. Only person that probably said anything was Slim Thug, and he's not from that region. But anyway. Since this La Rod situation and Stevie J name done popped up, you got people like Uncle Luke speaking out. You got Fat Joe speaking out. You got Peter Gunn speaking out. You got um, Mayweather speaking out. A lot of these niggas in cahoots with each other and they rock with Diddy. You feel me? That's why when they getting asked these questions about Diddy, they keeping it quiet. They trying to keep it street. Because ain't nobody... They don't want to rain on another black man parade from the street, dog. You feel me? Y'all know how it is. When they go down the street things, people tend to keep quiet. But not to get off subject, Shouter said, let's put the real focus on your true evil actions of raping me, physically abusing me. You are no longer my oppressor and my God will handle you from this point. And then she said this about LaRod. I'm deeply hurt by the lies in LaRod Jones' lawsuit. The claim that I'm a sex worker is 100% false and character assassination. I am retaining the attorney to explore all legal remedies against both. Now, she claimed that she finna pull some legal actions out on LaRod, which we know is not gonna do nothing. Cause let's just keep it a band. That man ain't got no reason to lie on you, Charlotte. You. Young Miami, a lot of y'all is in hot water right now. You feel me? I don't know what's the other chick name, but y'all is in trouble. Y'all careers is ruined. You try to do anything independently, they gonna rain on your parade. And not to mention, your baby daddy is about to do a documentary. You feel me? He is about to do a documentary of you being with his top out. How could you expect this man to show you some love or some type of leeway when you a sex worker for this nigga enemy, bro? Like, that's nasty work. You know your baby daddy and this, and this man don't see eye to eye, but you over there at his parties getting loose. Y'all on the clean. Y'all moving work. You feel me? Rodney Jones. I can't wait till some more uh, documents come out today because I know it's going to be something new every day. But y'all drop a comment below and let me know how y'all feel about that. Because I'm tired of women calling people a rapist. They just throwing that word around like a like a basketball when they get mad. Knowing that people going to pay attention to that. Like, I feel like 50 need to take her to court. You feel me? Drop a comment below, man. I'll be back.